What's going on everyone? It is CND back again and welcome to 2017 and welcome to my very own apartment. Ugh. Oh, I'm so excited to show you guys. I know you've been asking for this forever now, but I'm finally ready to show you guys. Uh, but quick backstory, just so you know, uh, I'm 19 right now. I just moved out of the house. Uh, last school year, I was a uh, I was a senior in high school, and now I am a freshman in college. Because the college doesn't have dorms on it, I had to get my own apartment. You guys don't understand. Like, I get like giddy with excitement every time, like just randomly. You know, every time I think about like. This is my own place, you know, I can deck it out with all the video game posters and whatnot I want to, like it, it's so cool. And yes, I am living on my own, so there's that as well. I don't know, it's just insane, like I didn't, like, there's obviously lots of stuff that's really hard, but there's tons of things that is just, it's so cool that I'm finally out of the house and on my own, and like, this is my own fridge over here, like, I have my own stove, look, this is a kettle. What is... So, without further ado, I'm gonna tour you guys around and uh, show you the whole crib here, and uh, you guys tell me what you think. Some dude plays violin a lot in my apartment, please. That's okay, all right. Just like tradition in all my other room tours, you gotta come in the front door, and right when you do, of course, you gotta take off your shoes, but then you walk over here, and you're, oh, some complimentary Gengar slippers. You need to just slip those on and you're ready to go. Excuse the floors, they're very squeaky. But anyways, you can go right here. Oh, right away, look at that. Hi, we got a nice mirror. Check yourself out before you, before you leave. Scented pine cones, because, you know, you want it to smell homey in here. So you come around here, then we got the coat closet. You know, whoopity doo dah lots of shoes and coats and whatever, who cares? Then you walk over this way. You can go this way to the kitchen, or you can go this way into the living room and everything else. But we'll check out the kitchen first. So this is my kitchen. It's very simple. It's very, who really cares? I mean, I care, whatever. Check out my little turtle I got. I got that in Puerto Rico. You guys will see those Puerto Rico videos on my vlog channel, which is happening soon. Portable speaker right there. Little electric stove, little kind of compact. It's not a full-size fridge. I got, there's like nothing in there, don't don't care about that. I'm trying to stay a little a green in here. Microwave, which I do like all my cooking out of. Got my dual Darth Vader mugs right there. So you know, if I have a if I have a girl over, you know, we wanna uh, snuggle up and, and have some some hot cocoa or something out of Darth Vader, you know. That's how that's how you get the girls. Just just so you know. Got it. Oh hold on. I got these nice covers and stuff. Yeah, you guys really don't care. Ramen, yeah. College life, am I right? All right, so then if you just kind of, you know, you just came from the door over this way and you come through this nice little doorway right here, come out of the kitchen and into this beauty. You can just go this way, through the kitchen out that way, or you can just go through this way. Right away, right here, we have the, uh, my little two person table here. Come around this way, we got the main event. Check it out. I got my big TV and I got an old TV. Before they used to all be on this one thing, or it was a small one, but my dad let me take this one, which it looks really nice, trust me, it, it, and it is, but it's actually like really old. He was also moving, or instead of getting rid of it, he gave it to me, which is awesome, thanks for that. Check this out, just like before, you guys have seen, I got the LED lights. Uh, with all the consoles, but now we have this extra one holding the uh, retro consoles. Uh, right here is some Chinese checkers, and then inside there is a bunch of extra controllers. We got all the cords kind of put back in this little N64 thing right there. This is the beauty right here. This is my my internet, which oof, I pay for like the best internet you can get, and it's oh, it's beautiful. Hey, real quick, just a side note, because I know a lot of you are probably wondering, like, how the heck does this kid afford all that? And you know, I just want to be real honest with you guys, uh, so I, I want to you know explain that real quick. So yes, my parents do help with a part of the rent, but it's just part of it, and the rest I have to pay for myself, along with all the other bills, be that electricity or internet or food, whatever. But yeah, I just wanted to clear that up in case anyone was wondering. We got the Atari, we got the Sega Genesis, got the Xbox, we got the Wii and the Wii U, uh, PS3, 2, and two different ones. There's the Wii U gamepad right there, a little Christmas tree, and then we got the uh, Loop gaming consoles. What? Loop? What? 
I ain't no sellout. What is, get that out of here. Anyways, continuing on, uh, we got the red chair right there with our radiators, which is what heats my whole apartment. It's, oh, it's so nice. This is like the handheld gaming corner right here because then if you come over here, we got the game case. Check it out. We go from retro NES to Super NES, a little bit of Atari, N64, down to GameCube, down to Wii and Wii U. Then over here, we got all the handhelds. It's pretty much set up just like it was before, if you guys remember. There's some more Game Boy games on display there. 3DS, DS, Genesis, which I got a lot of boxed games. It's awesome, thanks to Jacob. And uh, the, all the different Playstations. I know I have like no Playstation 3 games and some original Xbox and a Dreamcast uh, keyboard thing, which I just randomly got. So I don't have a Dreamcast yet. Then over here, you got the different controllers and stuff. I just kind of have one of each, kind of just to put on display and also just for easy access. You know, you just want to boom, bang, choo-choo train. And uh, this is actually a Chinese PSP that my Chinese friend just randomly gave me. <laughs> oh, and then... I don't know why, sand, what's so yeah, you wanna like grab the 3DS, you wanna hop down in the chair, there's actually a plug right there too, so you always stay charged, stay warm by the heater. Oh, and we got party light too if you wanna. Boom, instant party, it's it's lit. Do people say that anymore? That is, is 2017, I think we can stop. So yeah, for seating, we got the little love seat like we did before with my retro Star Wars pillow. We got the, I forgot what it is, like a pop, Papa something chair. It's a big long name, I don't know. And then we got my big sumo beanbag chair. Yeah, we got a little side table. This thing is so dirty. I live on my own. I can eat in front of the TV with the TV tray if I want to. Get out of here. Got some casual reading on the side there. Some more magazines down there. This bottle has literally been sitting here for so long and I literally just use it for bottle flips when I want to. And again, it's 2017. Are, are, are we done with doing bottle flips as well? I mean, I just, I just don't know. <gasps> no way. Oh my god. Got it lit, my little Christmas tree, showed all the games, whatever. So now you come over this way right here, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is my office. This is where the magic happens. Yeah, this is this is my office slash computer room slash collection room. Like holy crap, look how cool that background looks right now. First of all, we got my collection of figures and then plushies on top. We got a whole assortment of characters. I'm not gonna go through it all like I used to, but uh, I got a whole bunch of stuff in here and I love it all. And honestly, it hasn't updated that much since the last time you guys have probably seen it. I'll just show you my pride right there. That is a super old deck of miniature Nintendo playing cards before they were even anything about a video game. It's, that's so cool. Look at this hat. This hat, my uncle, when I went to Puerto Rico and I visited him, which again, you'll see soon on the vlog channel, uh, he was wearing this when he picked me up from the airport, which is uh, pretty awesome, kind of cringy. Anyways. All right, so this is more of the collection here. You can see, uh, if you come in here, we got uh, just a bunch of like the boxed special edition games. If you check it out, these are all the ones that are like plus amiibo, plus amiibo, plus amiibo, plus amiibo, plus amiibo. Just some more boxes and stuff. See, my collection isn't really that big. I'm just good at making it look big. Like these are literally just empty boxes of nothing. I got my binder of my Pokemon cards, which you guys know I got that first ever base set of Pokemon cards. You guys wanna go watch that. It's my most popular video. You should go check it out for sure. Continuing on, we got this little corner shelf, which is just has some random books and whatnot. I got a little VR, whatever, but up on top, one of my most prized possessions, besides the boxed silver and gold Mario Amiibo, we have the autograph of Mario himself, which I also made a video explaining how I got that. Check it out. You go from there, then we got some more posters on the side. We got the Smash Bros. ones uh, framed right there and right there. And then also, if you look behind the door, there is the other one. We got my big professional lights because you know I'm so professional. We got another one in the corner there with uh, that's uh, actually a puzzle that's framed right there. Up top, you can actually see these little uh, little bead art that I made. And they're uh, above the other window too. I actually like those ones with the, with the starters there. It's awesome. But anyways, come down here, check it out. We have my triple monitor setup. Look at that beauty. Oh my God. Here is the computer powering the pixels. It's an Asus something something. I don't even care. It's a 970 graphics card with an i5-6400 processor, 32 gigs of RAM, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Uh, and then yeah, actually, if you just come over here, just... 
What? Loot. Loot gaming? I get, get that out of here! I am not no sellout! Who do you think I am? Holy crap, just trying to sit down in my chair. Oh, gosh, I swear, it's such a hard life being a YouTuber. People just trying to, like... Anyways, so yeah, this is where I chill when I'm making my videos or whatever. This is a nice BenQ, like, console gaming monitor, 27 inches. It's awesome. Then over here, we have a just little mini Asus one. We got Sonico that just hangs out right here. The original Sonico's down there. Uh, nice little keyboard and mouse. We got the Elgato hooked up for streaming. Uh, this is a new cord I just got so I can record my iPhone, get some Mario Maker streams going on. Uh, over here we got the transmitter for my wireless headset, Astro A50, which in moving this part kind of broke off. Like I know it can snap off, but the actual thing broke off, so that sucks, but whatever. All right here we got the bell, so I tell you guys to ding that bell down below right now. You want to be notified when I... So yeah, you saw over here, we got the gold little Minecraft stuff. Uh, this is overflow of Amiibos because I can't fit them on the shelf over this way, which I'll show you in a second. We got some really cool Pokemon little poster type dealios right here. We got a big old desk right here, which is nice for doing any schoolwork or whatever. The little lamp. Ooh, and the sun just started to shine in. Oh my gosh. And then look at this. This is one of my favorite things in my collection right there. Check that out. That is the complete Amiibo collection. The only things I'm missing. So we got the Bowser and DK Skylander slash Amiibos. There's a dark version of those that I don't have. And then there's also some Japanese uh, exclusive Amiibos that I don't have. Here are all the Smash Bros. Amiibo that are out right now. It's insane. We're still waiting on those Bayonetta and Cloud. And then we got all the other type of Amiibo right up there. But. There's more because this is an apartment, right? And check this out. If we go out here, look at it. It's my own freaking bathroom. So yeah, if we come from the living room here, you got the game room in there, and then you just kind of walk this way and oh my freaking god. Get that. And you just go this way and you got the bathroom and you got my bedroom. So let's head into the bedroom real quick. I keep it nice and simple. Not many posters or anything on the wall, you know, because if I want to, you know, get it on in the bedroom, you know. But this is the real test. But let's let's imagine, right? I bring a, I bring a nice lady home here and I, I sit her down on the bed right here. And then this this is the test to, to know if she is uh is a keeper or not. So this is what we do, right? Kind of slowly and seductively close this door to reveal my huge wall scroll of Hatsune Miku. <laughs> So she, you know, she's sitting there and then she looks up and she's like, oh my god. So then the test is, if she's scared away by my anime, then she's not a keeper. She's just, just, bye, see you later. You're not worthy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you gotta keep your, keep your standards high, boys. All you, all you guys out there, keep your standards high. So there's my dresser, watches or whatever. I got my little mini manga collection here. A little candle. <laughs> Yeah, it smells good. A little dragon head. This guy just kind of got decapitated. See, so here's my nice bed. It's super comfy. Got the what? What the heck? Oh, are you kidding me? What? Oh, and then yeah, I got I got these posters too. <laughs> More Hatsune Miku uh, and uh, <laughs> walk out of the bedroom and you got oh oh. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, you've probably seen a few dancing pictures in front of this mirror before. <laughs> yeah, this is my closet. I got a lot of posters and stuff down there that I haven't messed with, and all my T-shirts and clothes and whatnot. Continuing on, we got my own bathroom. Oh my god! Oh, look at this. this. I don't know why I'm so excited, but it's my own. Fucking bathroom, you guys. Look at it. Look at it. Oh. Yeah, so you got your toilet, you got your sink, you got your high quality with jets and massager toilet. Uh, uh, toi uh, not toilet. B uh, bath right here. Are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready? Check this out. This is some high tech. Only the fanciest YouTubers in LA with their, their penthouse. They don't even have this, okay? Watch. What? Oh my. Secret. Oh my- oh. Die, con boys! Who do you think I am? What do you think 
this is. You get that out of here. I swear to God. You think, you think I'm just gonna sell up? You think I'm just gonna open your loot gaming and try to promote it to everyone? No, no. Get that out of here. I swear to God. Like, get, get that out of there. there. Alright. Now that that's over, um, thank you guys so much for... Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, give a like down below. And of course, ding that like button. If you enjoyed... <laughs> enjoy, 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 enjoy. If you enjoyed... Ow! I freaking unboxed you! Okay, that was really stupid. In all seriousness though, I uh, do obviously Loot Crate did come out and they're like, hey, we're gonna send you some free boxes, um, unbox them like you do and tell your people to go to go get some Loot Crate. And um, it's, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be 100% genuine and serious with you guys. If you guys like the content I make and you wanna see more, uh, I actually quit my job at a fast food restaurant recently and I'm trying to do just YouTube full time. So if, if you want to see videos like all the time, you know, there's different ways you guys can support me. It can be as little as just watching and liking my videos or coming on the streams when I do that. But also, here's another really cool way that you guys can directly um, benefit the channel. So there's a link down below, 10% off coupon. You guys know the drill. Um, but again, I'm gonna be serious with you guys. For every person that signs up, I get a part of that. So. That's helping me grow the channel, you know, get some new camera gear that I've been saving up for forever now. And um, you guys get some cool gaming gear. So it's a win-win situation. M -m -m money shot. I've always wanted to do that. Also, there's a lot of games and stuff that I just don't know about, like whatever this space pin is about. Um, any of this stuff that I get that I just don't really know or care about, um, I'll either like do a giveaway or um, I'm just gonna be, you know, giving to my friends or anyone that does like it. So, ooh, what is these? I don't know. What is that from? Ooh, we got a nice figurine from XCOM 2. Ooh, a Ratchet and Clank something. <laughs> it's it's one of the little it's a little weapon from Ratchet. Ratchet and it's a pen. <laughs> what? <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, look at that. Dragon Age, the heroes, Thetis, Castlevania, Lord of Shadows. Whoa, that is how we should unbox stuff. No. Oh, oh, okay. So yeah, if you guys want to support the channel, uh, get some cool stuff, it's a win-win again. So go use the link down below. But anyways, if you guys have made it this far, if you are a true CND fan, <laughs> I don't know, you are awesome, first of all. Secondly, I want to tell you, and you guys specifically, Sunday to Sunday, I'm going to be doing daily uploads. Because I'm done with school, I quit my job, and I'm, you know, I'm on break right now, Christmas stuff is over with, I'm going to try. It's going to be a challenge, basically. Never been done before on my channel. Every single day for seven days in a row, I'm going to upload a video. Please look forward for that. I hope you guys stick around, so subscribe down below. Anyways, uh, thanks for letting me show you guys around my place. I Tell me what you think down below, of course, and I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. You guys are awesome. Bye-bye.